All right, we're gonna work on adding layers and then using those layers to import an image that we can trace. So over here on the right-hand side of your screen, you've got a palette, um, I've got my puck, and then I have my layers here. So these are my layers. If I add the plus, I can add layers. I can move them by touching and holding on them. Um, if I were to draw on one, right, then it shows up. I can see what I've drawn on that layer over here on the right-hand side. If I touch the eyeball, it hides it. It doesn't delete it. It just hides it. Um, if I touch on a different layer and then change what color I'm writing in, then that will show up in that layer, right? So if I close that one, can mess with that. I can also lock it and then I think I can change what color I like what color I'm drawing in. So let's see if I can do that. Yeah, if you just scribble over it, it'll only affect what you've already done. So you can change that. Um, and then if I unlock it, you can still see it. Um, the other thing I can do is if I tap it, I can look at the blending, right? So I can darken, I can do linear burn, I can do all these things here. And then I can change the opacity to see how clear things are. So for example, if I drew a person, hide these layers here. If I drew a person, <laughs> super artiste that I am, and then add a layer on top of that, and I drew some hair on that person. Right, I could do that, and um, let's see if I can fill it. Yay. Right, the hair is on a different layer. So I could lock the hair by touching the lock and I could make it be pink by, let's see, what if I change this? Sorry. And by locking it and coloring it. I can also hide the hair so I can rearrange it. I can turn on my layers, right? Um, let's see, I want to turn off that layer. I want to work in the layer with the word high. And I'm going to turn on my selection tool. And I'm just going to select this. And I'm going to move it. Let's see if I can move it. Oops. Select it first. Then I'm going to put the transform. And move it by grabbing the middle of that. So now if I turn everything back on, oops, I can see everything. And then the last thing I want to do is tap and hold. And I can either merge these two layers, the one that I'm on and the one right below it, or I can merge them all. And now it's one solid drawing. So that's how you create layers and move around in layers.